Hi everybody, Paul here. When I drained the hydrostatic transmission oil in part one, what I didn't tell you was the oil color in the second hydrostatic transmission was completely gray, which had never happened to me before and I knew was not normal. Here's a video of the actual drain. The oil should have been a clear golden color just like when I drained it from the other hydrostatic transmission, but it was dark gray. Here's a better view of what it looks like. After doing some research, I realized what had happened. Not long ago, I power washed this piece of equipment and accidentally got some water in the hydrostatic system, which caused all of the oil to emulsify and turn gray. The way I fixed it was I simply flushed the hydrostatic transmission with new oil. First remove the hydrostatic transmission oil fill reservoir cap to help it drain faster. Remove the oil filter with something to catch the old oil. Drain as much oil as possible from the hydrostatic transmission and oil filter. If your hydrostatic transmission does not have a drain plug like mine, then just drain as much oil as you can with the oil filter removed, which in my case was one quart. The system holds more, but that's all I could get out at one time. Add new oil to the oil filter. Put new oil on the oil filter o-ring as needed. Clean the oil filter mating surface and reinstall the oil filter, which for now only needs to be hand tight. I filled the hydrostatic transmission oil fill reservoir with the rest of the new oil that remained in the one quart bottle. Be aware that it can be a little slow for the new oil to make its way into the system from the oil fill reservoir. I then free turned the drive wheels while safely supported off the ground. This reinitialized or recirculated the new oil with the old oil. To do this, I ran the engine at idle, engaged the transmission, and ran the drive wheels forward for five minutes. Then I ran the drive wheels backwards for five minutes and drained the oil again. I repeated this procedure until the drained oil returned to the same color as the new added oil, which in my case took six separate drains totaling six quarts of new oil. Also remember when you perform this procedure, you'll see thousands of tiny air bubbles in the drained oil which is completely normal. And last I tightened the oil filter. Now everything's back to running at optimum performance. I hope you found this helpful, and if you like this video, please hit the like button below, share it with your friends, and please be sure to subscribe. God bless you and have a great day. Bye for now.